Of the film has been well received by the audience. How does it feel? A very satisfying first because obviously we set out to do something new and unique and interesting and and we did it for the people who like it and we're very very happy with the response. Same here when uh, your experimentation or your hard work is uh, appreciated and approved by the audience it feels nice so who will say that. So did you expect her not to feel happy about it? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah so they say I feel happy so yeah. Tapsi, this question is for you. Pink Baby, The Ghazi Attack, RunningShadi.com and Naam Shabana, you have been doing some more incredible roles. What are your criteria when you pick those roles? I pick the directors most of the times because I feel a, direct, a good director can make an average film also really good. And then comes the script and my role. That's my, as simple as that. And I've not reached a position where I can say, okay, you make a film for me or you make a film for me. So I just choose from whatever options I get. I just choose from the best out of that. Rana, uh, you were shooting for Bahubali and the Ghazi attack at the same time. Right, was definitely. it challenging to move from one role to another? Well, it is It is a little bit because both are very character specific. Uh, Bahubali is a film, it's a war film, it's a, it's a medieval war film where I play a warlord and I kill bison with my bare hands and things like that. So I need to look the part. And this is obviously a, a it's, it's, it's based off a true event though it's a fictional tale in its form. The characters are real. The, they at least want to be. You want to make the audience feel that most of this actually actually happened. And uh, so there's a brief of how a submariner is, how a naval officer is. There's a sense of discipline. There's a sense of. I mean, if it's a body, it's it's a sense of being more agile, more athletic in form. So which is what I did for this film. So yes, but the bigger problem was to get back to Bahubali. I had to put that all back on. So that was a problem. Uh, Tapsi, you have a small part in the trailer. Not much being has been revealed. Can you share about your role in the film? So I play, uh, my character's name is Ananya. I play a Bangladeshi refugee. So this incident when it happened in 1971 is the same year Bangladesh was formed. From East Pakistan it became Bangladesh. So that's why my character, like the, we, we try to incorporate that fact also in the film. And my so hence my character is from that part of the world, that part of the land. And uh, she's a refugee, so she has seen her family uh, getting killed in front of her own eyes. So the, the only thing she's left with is herself, and she wants to really live. And it's not like she's given up on life. So she sa she saves herself out of it and runs away. And uh, she happens to come across this ac big accident, and these uh, naval officers save her from that and get her into the submarine. So you'll see me doing that. So as Ananya, physically and emotionally, how challenging the role was? See, physically, uh, not that much, frankly speaking, because uh, I was in, inside the submarine most of the time, just seeing whatever is happening or just being a part of the whole drama that was happening inside the submarine. But uh, mentally, a little bit, because uh, see, this, this character has seen so much happen in front of her eyes, uh, but still she has not given up on life. You have to be really strong from inside. You might just look that you've... You, you just lost everything from outside but inside the, you, you're extremely strong that's why you can probably still stay alive and be there in spite of losing everything in your life. Uh, Rana, you played the role of Commander Arjun Verma in film. How was your experience? Well, play, when you play anything which is associated with any armed forces that you have, uh, so obviously there will be a certain sense of uh, righteousness or discipline and patriotism and all of those that come in and very truthful, very uh, less emotional in terms of reactions and reacting to situations because obviously you're commanding a certain army at a, at a, at a very crucial point yeah, in, in life itself, it's between life and death that you play. So I mean it's, it's all of those, you'll have every line of yours is very measured, very correct, it's not, uh, there's no loose talk, there'll be no randomness in, uh, in, in character or any kind of fluctuation. Okay. So how was your experience working with Tapsi? Well, obviously, it's always like this is the third film that I've been together with her. Uh, whether it's I did a Tamil film before, I did Baby before, and, and somebody I've known all my life. I've known her for the last seven, eight years uh, from sh when she's become an actor. I mean, I'm very fond of her as a human being. I'm very fond of the kind of cinema that she does, and it's I'm very happy that she's part of this film, and uh, and and I'm very happy the, with the kind of work that she does. And how was your experience, Tapsi? Outstanding. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, one word he's answered it. But Outstanding. Then <laughs> it could be, there's nothing else. Tapsi has nothing else to say with this. No, <laughs> I, 
yeah that th- we have worked together we've been like uh, funnily we were sun in telugu but never got to work in telugu together so this is the the film that we have uh, we are doing in telugu and hindi as well so uh, nice to be in working on the set with him because i've known him as a person now i know him as an actor is also after this film working with him uh, after i would like to really do a full fledged film with him where i can like work with him for l- more number of days but i really look forward to it uh, with the kind of track record we have had together bo- with both the films that we have done before i think we are again going to nail it indeed indeed rana is such a serious actor even behind the cameras or does he play pranks or fun he is anything but serious behind the camera <laughs> yeah let me tell you that <laughs> how different it was working with tapsi for this time like in gazi well see obviously when you work with just putting her aside as a human I mean, if you just look at her as an actor she's a very fine actor she's somebody who's evolved very very beautifully over time and uh, it always adds a lot to the film lots to all of us and uh, and this kind of support that a fine actor like her does accentuates what the scene is completely so what are your future plans like after the gazi what are your future plans No, my future plans in, in life. Like, no, 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 no. <laughs> oh, then? Obviously, the life. <laughs> okay. that, that's a part of your life. Your future projects. Right? Well, I have I have a film called Bahubali that comes two months after Gazi does, and and yeah, I have a bunch more coming in this year. We have lots of films coming coming up, so I'll talk about it as and when. Uh, yeah, so every time it's in India, I'll keep coming back here and talking to you, <laughs> and she'll be here talking to you all the time. Yes, for all my films. Uh, Rana, if audience will audience will get the. Answer that Katappa ne Bahubali ko kyu mara in Bahubali two. That's the whole reason we made this film. <laughs> uh, so that it's the conclusion, it's the answer. Yes, they will. Okay, it's so the final question. Uh, Tapsi, there's a matrimonial site Shadi dot com, which has filed a case against your running Shadi dot com to change the title. What's your take? It's done. The case is sorted. We have changed the name. Now it's running Shadi. Does it make a difference? <laughs> I don't think so. Okay, thank you. So thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you.